I'd like to preface this video by emphasizing this is an RNG game, but there are many things that you can do to improve your chance at getting things in this game. My name is Weds. In this video, I'm going to show you how to improve your chance at getting Shield Collector, an extremely rare module and a pain in the ass to get. It is highly sought after, though it is currently bugged as the making of this video and not working as it's supposed to. I will show you the alternative module to use until they fix Shield Collector. Anyway, I have tested a few methods and the one that works for me was simply by following these techniques I'm about to show you. First of all, here's some knowledge for you. Once you have this knowledge, I think it will make sense to you. Anyway, here's a document that I have been using to form this rare module. So there is a method to the madness, just like what I did to get shot focus, another extremely rare module that is highly sought after for people using weapons build. I have a video on that on the channel. Check it out if you are trying to get shot focus. It might help you out. In any case, first thing you need to know in case you didn't know, with the exception of transcendent modules, when you combine four modules of this same rarity, you have 90% chance of getting that same module rarity. Meaning, when you combine four ultimate modules, there is 90% chance to get another ultimate module. So that means you have a 10% chance at getting a transcendent module when you combine four ultimate modules. The same concept applies for normal and rare modules. However, when you combine four transcendent modules, you have 100% chance to get another transcendent module. It's guaranteed. That's the exception I mentioned earlier. So, let us take a look at this spreadsheet to show you what I was just talking about. By the way, this spreadsheet is based on data from Nexon's website, and these wonderful people on Reddit put it together for the community. However, they stopped updating it because they lost interest in the game. But still, go give them an upvote on Reddit if you have not done so yet. The link for this is always in the description of any of my videos. So here's this sheet. As you can see, the guys, they put a note here, so they're not updating it anymore because they lost interest in the game. But this is a very good document. Everything you see here is still working, and uh, you can still use all the data that you see here. Now, what we are interested in today is the modules combining data. So if you click on this, and this is everything that you have to look at. Now, as I was saying, when you put four modules together of the same type, like for instance, you put four standard modules together, and then you're going to have a 90% chance of getting a standard module. And the other 10% is going to be a rare module because rare is higher than standard. So if we go down, for example, if we go down to... Ultimate module four ultimate module. And if you look, you're going to have 90% chance of getting another ultimate module. And the other 10% chance is for a transcendent module. So that means you have a 10% chance to get a transcendent module when you combine four ultimate module. That's what I will explain to you. And the four transcendent modules, when you put them together, it's a hundred percent. You're going to get a transcendent module. That is proven and every time you put four of them together you get another one you don't know what you're gonna get but it's going to be a transcendent module when you put four of them together now knowing all of that what can you do to increase your chance at getting shield collector like i mentioned before i am pretty sure shield collector is currently bugged and i will show you a gameplay as proof that i don't think it's working as intended Anyway, let me show you what you need to do to have a better chance at getting Shield Collector. So if, if we come here to see that guy Cillian, and you want to combine modules. Alright, right now I can have it on Ultimate, because what you need to do, just make sure you sort it by quantity. And also, since 
the module you're looking for is an ultimate module just sorted by ultimate now for the socket type this really doesn't matter but you can actually go and just mess around with it if you want but don't worry about this but make sure that it, this is a descendant module because you're going to put it in your descendant sheet so make sure it is on the descendant and then from there just combine four of them but i will say this if you put a, a collector module on there you might have a better chance of getting that shield collector like a potent collector or mp collector which is what i did i put an mp collector and then a couple of other module but they are all descendant module so that's what the most important thing is is make sure they are descendant module now there are some combination for other modules like they have to be a certain type the socket type like c type like for the shot focus if you put c together then you have a better chance of getting it as long as they're all descendant so there's a method to the madness although it's still rng just like when you go farm for other modules that are in the world of uh, first descendant they always put like a percentage on it like two percent or two point five percent or five percent so there's a percentage i don't know what percentage it is here it's probably even lower than what you see in the wild world of the first descendant but there is a percentage and if you try those techniques you have a better chance at getting them instead of trying to put all the crazy modules together again it's still rng you do what you gotta do but try what i just told you and you should be good to go now even if you want to copy the same module that i put together there might be a chance that you get it you never know that's how this works it is rng again it is rng now if you are having a very hard time trying to get shield collector there is a replacement just use biosync shield this is really good as you can see in the background gameplay i was missing some shield but once i go and pick up some of those orb the health orb then i regen my shield in comparison to when i have shield collector on and i kill the enemy and i don't get no shield regeneration so shield collector is currently bugged as far as i can tell but biosync still works now if you want to get biosync it's easier to get than shield collector just go kill dead bride a few times and you might be able to get it there are other places to get biosync shield but the easiest place that i found to get it was killing dead bride a few times and then i was able to get it so now i can use it instead of using shield collector until they fix shield collectors anyway that is all we have for this video hopefully this helps you out hopefully you go out there and get those modules if you looking to get modules just go do the 400 percent invasion the new activity and you'll get a chance to get a lot of modules from in that activity they drop a lot no matter the rarity they drop from there they drop from there i got a lot of transcendent module just by doing the 400 percent invasion or infiltration anyway thank you so much for watching i will see you guys in the next one